Good morning, Fields Falcons. We are here for another week as we continue with our distance learning. So we wanna get started by thanking all of you for the work that you have done and the work that you continue to do. We're gonna get started with our Pledge of Allegiance and salute to the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. At this time, please pause for a moment of silence. Thank you. <clears throat> Continuing once again, today is Monday, April 13th, 2020. This month, um, McAllen ISD is celebrating the month of the military child. So we do wanna thank not only our men and women that serve, but also their families and the children that support them. We are also celebrating acts of kindness this week. So today's act of kindness is tell someone how much you love and appreciate them. And boys and girls, teachers, field staff, field community, I love and appreciate every single one of you. Boys and girls, I do want to remind you that we are falcons and that falcons soar. This means we show respect, own our actions, act safely, and rise to the challenge. And we do that all the time, boys and girls. That is the behavior that we expect from all of our falcons. Now for some words of wisdom. Is there someone here at school that you think may need a little kindness? Do you know of a student that has been treated hurtfully or someone who may feel lonely? You could be nice to that person. You could ask him or her to sit with you at lunch or you could send a note with kind words. Even small acts of kindness help spread love. Many, many years ago, someone very wise said, wherever there are people, there is a chance to be kind. We can all look for chances to be kind. We can be nice to one another. We can love one another. It's part of being a responsible person. Responsible people take responsibility for the way they treat others. Today, put love into action. Be kind to others. With something to think about, this is Ms. Tretla. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. Students, teachers, and staff, this goes along perfectly with our kindness week. Um, please continue to put love into action and be kind to others. Boys and girls, that also includes being kind in the things that we are sending to each other via technology. Please make sure that you are continuing to use kind words. So your writing prompt is responsible people take responsibility for the way they treat others. Why is it responsible to treat others with kindness and respect. So we look forward to you thinking about that, boys and girls. Again, this is Random Acts of Kindness Week. We are celebrating being kind to others. So today, again, is tell someone how much you love and appreciate them. We would love to hear your thoughts. Um, Victor Fields Elementary on Facebook, at Twitter, at Fields Falcons, hashtag Fields Inspires, hashtag Falcons are kind. Boys and girls, staff members, if no one else has told you today, I love each and every one of you very much. Um, <clears throat> please um, remember that you are special and that you are loved. And again, I love each and every one of you very much. As always, boys and girls, staff members, please remember to work hard and be kind. Thank you.